Working with the C500 is actually quite simple. Let's take a look at its features and operation. All display information is obtained by pressing the blue display button. Color temperature is read out in Kelvin. Lens filtration is displayed in actual filter numbers. This is Kodak's Rattan filter designation, which is also used by the Lee filter system. Light source filter index numbers correspond to Lee and Roscoe light source filter systems and light source brightness in Lux or foot candles. The ProDigi C500 operates like all Sakonic light meters and reads both ambient and flash. However, for the purpose of color, not exposure. Press the mode button and turn the jog dial and you go from ambient light readings to cordless flash with 90 second reading delay that resets after each measurement. Cord connected flash. And for the C500R, radio flash triggering with 32 channels and four zones for pocket wizard flash systems. Traditional color meters only offered three film selections because digital cameras allow the photographer to choose any color temperature, the C500 also gives you this important control. Simply press the set K button and turn the jog dial to match the meter's reading to whatever color temperature you desire. The filter number changes to indicate the filter you should use. Pressing the preset button and turning the jog dial allows you to call up one of 19 user-created color corrections. This function will be of great interest to film shooters. You can custom name your presets for easy identification, in this case for fluorescent lighting. Press the menu button to enter the meter's setup functions. Turning the jog dial gives you access to digital or film sensitivity, set range for high or low power flash, white balance compensation, and custom settings. To select digital or film sensitivity mode, press the measuring button and turn the jog dial to select digital or film. Press the measuring button again to set it. And finally, the menu button to return to normal operation mode. Flash measurement has two ranges. To set the range, press the menu button, turn the jog dial to select the set range, Press the measuring button and then change to high or low. Press the measure button and then the menu button to get back to normal operating mode. The white balance set enables entering color correction values to get proper white balance. You can also use presets to memorize light source color so you can recreate it anywhere, anytime. To enter settings, press the measure button several times. The blinking display is the one that can be adjusted using the jog wheel. You can also create an eight character name to make identifying it easier. Once finished, press the menu button to return to the normal operating mode. In the custom setting menu, you can adjust the meter to your specific shooting needs. You can adjust the shutter speed for a full one half and one third stop increments. Set the ambient light brightness display to read out in foot candles, lux, both, or no readout. Under auto off, you can set the meter to automatically turn off in 5, 10, or 20 minutes, or always stay on. Under LB filter, you can select the direct filter number types from either Kodak Rattan and Lee filters, or the Fuji film system. For light source filtration, adjust LB step. You can set the filter index to read out in the Myrid or Decromyrid system. Finally, you can adjust the target Kelvin values to a variety of film or digital settings. Press the menu button to get back to normal operating mode. A very useful function is the C500's brightness difference display. First, let's take a color or brightness reading. Press the memory button to see the blinking M on the display. Now take a second reading by pressing and holding the measuring button. You can see the color or brightness difference between the two light sources. This is especially useful when equalizing a series of lights to a standard. Rounding out the C500 color meters feature list are a rotating head, 
the electroluminescent display that comes on in low light, and a tripod socket. The C500 is powered by two readily available AA size alkaline, lithium, or rechargeable batteries. The Sekonix C500R adds a built-in pocket wizard transmitter. It also shares the same 32-channel, four-zone system found in the L758 and L358 exposure meters. Well, there you have it, the C500 and C500R, digital or film, the ultimate meters for color control.